up, everybody? How you doing? Welcome back to Horror Hangout. I hope you're all having a great day. Um, yeah, thank you for joining me, man. Your time is appreciated. So, this is a Patreon request. So, anybody that's interested in my Patreon, there's a link in the description. Um, <clears throat> excuse me. I'm working on getting some uh, better rewards for my Patreon members going real soon. I'm going to have you doing handmade merch. And uh, I, I know how to silk screen and things like that. So, I'm going to be doing handmade merchandise. And every month, I'm going to give away a free shirt to somebody uh, in Patreon. And then discounts and things like that. So if you're interested in that, there's a link in the description. Uh, shout out to Jamie Smith. She's a, a, a longtime supporter of the channel. Both my channels, in fact. And this was her request. And I got to say, I would probably uh, have been upset had she not mentioned this to me. Because this looks cool, as far as I can tell. And I've, <laughs> I'm saying that based on a thumbnail. So, But this is called, a movie called The Sadness. I was getting ready to do a Frankenstein NECA figure unboxing. So keep your... Uh, eyes peeled stay tuned whatever for that video coming up pretty soon but let's get into this trailer man it's called the sadness it looked like it was from uh an asian country so i don't i'm not sure if this will be in english or not but um whatever let's do it i always like raven banner stuff they make good movies all right 就不会有人注意我，也不会有人伤害我。Man, so many people won't watch stuff with subtitles, and they're missing out on so many great movies, specifically Asian movies. I like, uh, well, I like Japanese horror movies. I like Korean like drama thriller horror movies, and I like Chinese like crazy action movies. Um, so much good stuff comes out of Asia. Anyways. Today我才知道 See that guy's arm getting stomped? Nah, bro. Um, oh, that looks horrible. So this is like a zombie outbreak type movie, huh? They've been bringing some good stuff from over there as far as this subgenre of horror is concerned for the last couple years. I can't remember the names, but there's one that was on Netflix that was amazing. Uh, yeah, this looks cool, man. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> That's not coming until next year. Boo. Boo. Where's that coming out? Is that going to be on a, a streaming service of some kind? I really hope so. That looks amazing, dude. And I, you know what I like about that, though, is that they gave us very little information about the movie, but they still gave us enough to make me, like, super into it. Uh, I'm not the kind of guy that gets super mad about spoilers, but I do appreciate a good trailer that's made that doesn't ruin an entire movie. So... What do y'all think about Asian cinema, specifically Japanese horror and Korean like thriller horror movies? Uh, you into them? Do you care about subtitles? Do you do? You, does that bother you enough to make you not want to watch a movie? As an example, man, I'm sorry. Parasite is probably one of the best movies I've seen in the past ten years, right? Like, I'd say top ten, top five. Uh, but I know a lot of people that haven't watched it. They just simply won't watch it because the subtitles. And I, I just don't understand it. That movie is fantastic. But uh, anyways, I'd love to know what you think about that. Jamie, I'm excited for this. Thank you for letting me know about it. Uh, if you know where it's coming out at, if it's, if it's going to be streaming, let me know in the comments. But uh, yeah, thank you so much for joining me, everybody. I got an unboxing to do, so I'll see you soon. All right, take care. Peace.